Hello, welcome to the next video. I want to show you how to go for the Rifleman Pass Tech build with Archmage first and Dark Ranger second. I show you that build order on Tide Hunters. We play against Orc. And what is important to know is I go for an aggressive approach, okay? That means I go for that green spot and then this creep spot and I'm going for the base immediately. So we force our opponent to play more passively and I make sure that I get map control like here, alright? We do that by being aggressive and this is a style you can do twice like this is a this is a style you can do play once upon a time. This is a style which is very effective because it surprises your opponent, the Orc player in this case. You see I'm going for a tower, that means I go for a 24 supply and then we tag. And what I do is I'm not taking... Lisha to creep this. So we got more wood and we can attack faster. Okay, that's the reason why I'm not taking any militia to creep that. I'm immediately upgrading this tower, make sure the footmen are in this position, then attack, and then just go for the creeps. Why do we do that, the split? Just because um, if you don't split the footmen like that, they will get ensnared and you will creep slower than you can, all right? Because they will not attack the creeps. All right. Now we attack immediately, 24 supply. We creep this. Now we go to this spot. With the next 100 wood, we will go for deep and upgrade, okay? That's a special one on this map. I like to play this because deep and upgrade will be ready when we finish this green spot and we can do pressure on that base all right now with the next 60 foot we go for a blacksmith and with the next 20 foot and 80 gold we go for the third farm make sure you get this macro right practice this over and over again and it will feel more comfortable over time okay so now we got level two you see it's finished in a few seconds now we say like oh hey orc we go for the for the boros oh he's here it's a computer normal and now we can go for that right you got two water elementals because he crept crept this and now we kill a boro which is very unusual right he kills one footman it's a good trade and now we run away normally <laughs> the orc doesn't wait in this space but he's uh, very smart he knows what i'm gonna do we tag, we go for another farm, just make sure you get enough supply for your rifleman, your second hero. He can go for boots, so most of the time the orcs likes to go for headhunters. We got a blacksmith right now, we build another rifleman. And you see he's waiting again for us. We can focus those headhunter, make sure you move your archmage like that, so... You can save this footman, you kill one headhunter, for example, and you ran out. We did enough damage, okay? Now, this footman goes home. We're here, and now we get the Dark Ranger. What's so strong about the Dark Ranger? First of all, it's a tavern hero. It means this hero is immediately available. So you got your second hero faster than your opponent. Make sure that you build this Sanctum right away when you got tier 2. And now if you just focus those Headhunter, okay? Alright. Well, normally he doesn't have <laughs> Shadow Hunter and Heal. But for example... So... We got it along the headhunter, now we go back. For example, right? This is a bad example actually, because everything is red. And normally he doesn't wait there like that. But 
Also, I want to show you just the build order. Build another farm, and then you go for the upgrade. So just build a priest, and then we go for the upgrade right now. So, we gotta creep those green spots. We skip the shop so we can build everything else, okay? Make sure we get healed by the priests, right? And now you play more passively when your army is like that because you don't want to get creep checked. It will be very bad for us. So we make sure that we just don't lose any units right now. We heal ourselves. We get enough supply like that. All right, and now we got heal. You see, I don't like to play a lot of region. I don't like to play with too many region scrolls from the shop because mana is for free, right? So we have more gold for units left. Now we can push. We go for a more aggressive creep spot. Make sure you heal everything. We get silence as a second skill. We pull those Elisha. Now we get the invo pot, right? And we go for a push. Now you can go... When you have three priests, you go for the upgrade. And now you push, right? So we go, for example, for that. His build order is very good. <laughs> Not. But it, it's okay. Just to show you how to play this build order, right? Now you go, for example, for the peons, so you get skeletons. In this case, he's offering me them. All right, we try to pull back. We build towers here. Okay, he's attacking everything. We go for the heal scroll, so nothing dies right now. And you see, you try to... Let's go for that, right? We get more and more skeletons. You see that? Just focus, fire. We kill those snakes with the water elemental. Alright, make sure you won't get something killed here. We did it! I think we won this game. And that's how you play Dark Ranger second Rifleman build with priests. It's very strong. You can go for more upgrades. And then you go for more sorceresses when he goes for more grunts, etc. Alright, thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye. Have a good week.